assalamu alaikum family welcome back to another video Hope everyone it's doing well it's your sister zainab here if you're new to my channel and if you are returning welcome back in today's video it's another cook with me video guys as you can see i have started preparing the meat just cutting and very small pieces that's what i'm trying to do here so yeah we're going to make um it's mutton i'm gonna make uh mutton i'm gonna make vegetable rice i'm going to make also salad it's a uh, yeah so guys after breakfast i went to 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 spa i wanted to get some mixed vegetable the frozen one frozen vegetables because i didn't have that so i went to spa it's the nearest uh supermarket from where i'm living um yeah so i bought that and also i wanted um avocado <laughs> i wanted avocado i bought avocado so and yeah i just walked because it's not it's not far from where i'm living i walked and yeah guys so here i'm preparing the garlic and ginger i love using fresh garlic and ginger when i make my curries i think it has more flavor than the one is already made from checkers and those are already made uh the mixed one there's a uh, mixed ginger and garlic which we they sell in the in the supermarkets i don't like that one i just feel like the taste is just different i like to make my own yeah guys um so i'm preparing that and i'm going to blend it okay we'll need pressure cooker for this in here i'm gonna add meat i'm gonna add three tablespoon of ginger and garlic paste i'm gonna add some spices like chili powder um as you can see it's not much i don't i don't add too much uh chili powder turmeric powder and teaspoon of salt which i already add now we're adding um cumin powder black pepper and coriander powder okay now we're going to cut onion just half of onion and one tomato we don't want too much onion onion because it's not even uh, that much meat it's 400 gram of mutton and yeah so half half of onion and one tomato will do this recipe don't want too much onion or tomato also because it's curry it's it's mutton curry i'm making guys yeah so i'm adding some water there we don't want too much water also and mix it mix it cover the pot i'm going to let it boil when the, the whistle start whistling we are boiling for 15 minutes okay after 15 minutes you off the flame and let the steam finish first and you take out the whistle in meanwhile i'm going to soak my rice only two cups will do and now i'm cutting another onion it's a, another half of onion this is for rice okay we're gonna use this onion for rice okay i'm done with onion now in the pot i'm gonna add some oil add the onion fry for a few minutes two to three minutes don't have to be brown and then here i was just making ready my um <clears throat> vegetable just to open the packet this is a mixed veg uh it's a frozen mixed vegetable yeah and i add half one and a half cup of the vegetables i'll fry for a few minutes as well and two uh norox chicken chicken norox and some black pepper also half teaspoon of black pepper and four cups of um four cups of water okay so 
while waiting for the water to boil i strained my rice i don't know if you guys noticed i did not add any salt here because of that two chicken norox i add it has salt so you don't add salt same time you have to wait when you add water then you taste if there is enough salt if it's not just add a bit of salt okay yeah so i just covered the pot of rice i'll check that later now let's just open the pressure cook and see if the meat is cooked the meat was perfectly done now i'm going to transfer it into this pot here and yeah i will go back and check my rice and then we're going to get back to the uh, meat so the rice as you can see the water is finished not completely that's why we just have to slow the flame and cover the pot we're going to leave it on steam for 10 to 15 minutes it's after 15 minutes and the rice is ready back to the meat as you can see guys the water is completely finished now i'm gonna fry the meat i will add some oil a bit of coriander powder a bit of cumin powder garam masala and some black pepper because we love spicy i'm gonna add some green chili as well after adding all the spices we we're gonna fry for 10 minutes okay guys and then i'm gonna add a tablespoon of yogurt and then i'm going to cook that yogurt for five minutes add some coriander uh, fresh coriander cook that for two minutes and then i'm going to add a cup of water just for to make a sauce after adding water i'm gonna mix it and i'm going to slow the flame cover the pot and let it simmer for another five minutes after five minutes it's done next i'm going to prepare the um, it's mint and avocado sauce or chutney. I'm gonna wash that and put in the blender. I'm gonna add a piece of avocado, some salt, some black pepper, a piece of ginger, and one clove of garlic. Now I'm gonna add some water and blend it into smooth paste. And voila, it's ready so how this work we need um, a bowl plain yogurt i'm gonna add two tablespoons of plain yogurt add that um the mixture of mint and avocado add some water mix 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 and this is how it looks like this is how it should look like this is delicious guys it's so delicious if you eat with rice or even eat papa so here I'm preparing my salad, which I already cut everything. So here we got uh, green pepper, yellow pepper, red pepper, carrots, tomato, and cucumber. Uh, those green, li green leaves, it's a uh, fresh coriander. I'm adding some oil, a tablespoon of mayo, some black pepper. I'm going to add aromat as well. And one tablespoon of uh lemon juice then i'll just mix 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 everything oh we almost forget the onion chopped onion as well guys yeah so now mix 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 everything and our salad is ready this is the most delicious salad easy to prepare and it's so 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 delicious and healthy okay <laughs> yeah guys uh, so yeah I, i'm done i'm done i'm done with my cooking guys so look how i decorate my plate guys i put some um piece of avocado on the edges of the plate hey guys yes and yeah we're done we're done it looks beautiful it looks so cute yeah i really like i loved this um 
the way I put everything here, it looks really nice, the salad and yeah, the rice is ready, our curry is ready, everything so yummy yummy guys. Anyways, we have come at the end of the video, hope you all enjoyed watching and I will see you all in my next upload. I love face, don't forget to like, subscribe if you're new, share and bye.